Hi everyone, welcome back to Subnautica. This is episode 12. Okay, I've uh, I created a couple of titanium ingots. I I need more of them. Uh, I need six more titanium and six lithium. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and yeah, we'll, we'll just turn all those into whatever we need. Um, I should take this opportunity to change out my batteries. So one, two, three, four. What have we got? That's at 98%. That's at 83%. Um, we'll do this. Okay, so 97. That's now 100. That's now 100. Um, oh, that one's very bad. 100. 100. Okay, let's get these things charging as soon as possible. Um, 98. That won't take long to charge. It's fine. Um, okay, we'll make that number two. We'll make that number three. That's kind of what I want. Okay, so I'm going to go and do the captain's quarters um, and pick up that battery I missed before when I was uh, doing the Aurora. While I'm out there, I'm also going to grab some diamonds, I hope. And also some quartz. So lots of stuff that I want to do. Right now I'm just making those three plasteel ingots that I want. Um, the quartz is required for enamel glass, of course. Okay, so what have we got? We got our three plasteel ingots. What do we need for this? Yeah, and we need a lubricant, advanced wiring kit, and three lead. We need quite a few things, so I'm going to just leave the plasteel in here for now. Um, yeah, I mean, we could we, we could make a, a take a big chunk out of what we need to do, so that when we have our, our quartz, we can just immediately make the cyclops. Probably not going to get around to making the cyclops this episode, because there's just too much to do. But uh, we can be all set and ready to go next episode. So we've got the lubricant. We've got three plus steel. We need three lead. We need an advanced wiring kit. Advanced wiring kit is like... Uh, that's needed for the computer chip. Um, that's the wiring kit. Um, we gold. I think we need three gold. Yeah, well, we'll get this. We need three gold and we need one more coral. So, we'll go grab some coral right now. Just slowly hacking away at this mountainside here, just destroying all the coral up here. Did I get it all? Quick fingers, just click, 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 click. Oh, I got three again this time. That's good, I now have an even number. I'm happy about that. Uh, let's grab our gold. There we go, three gold. One, two, three. And hopefully that's enough for our advanced wiring kit. Got the computer chip. And advanced wiring kit, there we go. Oh, no, all good, all good. We'll chuck that in there. We'll chuck the advanced wiring kit in there. Um, we got the plastier. We got the lubricant. Wait, do we have the lubricant? Did we... Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I grab a creep vine seed or not? Oh, yeah, I did. We got the lubricant. Good. I honestly couldn't remember doing it. Um, plasteel, lubricant, advanced wiring kit. Three lead is just downstairs. We just need the enamel glass. So we need six quartz. Yep. So we'll grab the three stalker teeth now. One, two, three. Um, yeah. And the three lead. It was three, wasn't it? I'm pretty sure it was three. Yep. 
Six quartz, and we have a cyclops. Oh, that's not lead. I'm like, where's all the lead gone? One, two, three, there we go. And we'll chuck the titanium back. Don't need this. We'll chuck everything in here. We'll uh, get ourselves fed and watered. Yeah, we literally have everything but the quartz. Um, 65%, it's fine. So yeah, we get ourselves fed on water. We'll check on our bioreactor really quickly, because uh, there's probably nothing in there anymore. Why are there fish swimming through my base? I just ran into it quick. Yeah, we need one more tree sample in here. Well, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll just keep hacking away at this. Because we're gonna... And boop, there we go. You guys just keep keep producing power for me. Thank you very much. Why are there fish inside my base? I'm not happy about this. That's good enough, honestly. I'm happy with that. Um, med kits. We'll keep the med kits. We'll keep them both, because I have something special planned. Six quarts. And we'll go to the captain's quarters, we'll get all that stuff done. Yeah, I'm taking this out. Um, where's my... There it is, this is where I want to go. Spider-Man. Ah. Uh, I shouldn't hold my finger on the shift key, well, on the jump key for so long. Most people use space as jump. I tend to prefer shift most of the time. I'm weird. Okay, so... Um, that's the back of the ship. We don't want to go to the back of the ship. There's a chest here. We'll grab that. Battery. God, it's just a battery sitting there this whole time. We're getting there, we're getting there. The other thing about this is it can go up on land. I could take it onto the island if I want to. Look how fast I'm going. Uh, we're meant to be looking for quartz. I'm just having so much fun being Spider-Man that uh, I'm not actually looking around for the... Oh, whoops. Come on. I'm not actually looking for the resources I need. Diamond, quartz, and I want to do the captain's quarters. Okay, so where's the entrance to this thing? Something's making a growling sound. Oh, is that a Reaper Leviathan making a growling sound? Guess what, dude? I'm not scared of you anymore. That's right. You come and take me on, you're going to get a rude shock. Anyway, I don't have time to play with the Reaper Leviathan right now. Let's uh, not miss the beam. Get, get me up there. Oh, okay. We'll use the shift button. There 
There we go. Whoops. Come on, come on, come on. Oh god. Come on, let me on. It's not... Ah! No! Ah, oh, this is so bad! I'm falling down the side of the building! Yeah, right, there we go, there we go. Get up there. Good. Um... Okay, so here's the problem with the... with the prawn. You, you, you can get... it can be really fiddly in certain places. Should be good now. Let me up. This is why the jump jets are so good. Because you can just jump jet your way everywhere. But yeah, I can just park this thing. I can't actually take it in. As much as I'd love to, that would be so cool. Um, so I'm just going to leave it out here. It should be fine. Um, oh, I've left the light on. See how it sits there? Um, how do you turn the light off? Um, Oh, well, it doesn't matter. You can just sit there, my friend. All good. Okay, we're going to the captain's quarters, and we're going to try and find that um, that battery that we missed. This is probably not the best way to do this. Probably. Oh, the other thing I noticed on a rewatch was I never downloaded this thing. Gosh. Data bank corruption was detected on your PDA. Your technology blueprints have been updated. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, that was one thing that I missed. Just re-watching episodes, um, just to see what I was doing last. And, yeah, I noticed I forgot that download. Drives me crazy watching myself play. I just missed so much. Uh, the second thing I noticed was a battery on the ground in the locker. It's amazing how, um, like, when you're actually videoing and trying to talk about what you're doing as you go, you, you just, your senses are just not as, you know, aware as if you're just playing on your own in silence. Because you like, you're so busy thinking about here. This is what I missed. You're so busy thinking about what you're, um, what you're talking about that you don't. Yeah, I didn't think that was anything. You're so busy thinking about what to, what you're going to say next that you're, you're not paying attention to the screen and you end up making all sorts of elementary mistakes it's not until you actually start videoing yourself and doing things like like this that you actually realize how hard it is how, how difficult it actually is to um to, to like make you know youtube content and stuff like that Okay, so captain's quarters. We want to go all the way over here. There should be a lot of luggage on the ground, yeah. This is it. Okay, we want to go in here. Now, the code should be in the data bank, probably, under codes and clues. Captain's quarters, we'll go 2679. Alien facility locations? Wow. Okay, yeah, I need to go check that out, but first let's, uh, 2679. Captain's quarters, here we go, data pad. Captain's log. Yeah, okay, so we don't, uh, I don't need to read any of that. You guys want to play this game, you can read it yourself. Okay, this is it, I think. Integrating new PDA data. Blueprints Neptune Escape Rocket? Neptune Escape Rocket. Time capsule. So you get all sorts of cool stuff now. So where is this Neptune Escape Rocket? Let's have a, just have a look at what the requirements are to make a Neptune Escape Rocket. Uh, where is it? Creature decoy. There we go. Neptune Launch Pad. 
titanium ingots, computer chip, lead. That's actually not too bad to do, but I, I cannot escape the planet because the moment I try and take off the um, the alien machine will, will shoot me down. Camera drone. Okay. Cool. I think you have to make the launch pad first and then it tells you the next step. Um, okay, anyway. Um, in here we've got an Aurora miniature. And... Isn't there like a captain's hat or something? Aurora poster. Is there anything on the ground? No, I don't see anything else. Okay. That's it. That's all I've done. I'm finished with the Aurora now. Well, I'm not actually. There's stuff everywhere. I can pick up posters and all sorts of things. How much space do I have? i got tons, but I don't want to save space for like diamonds and quartz. Um. Is there anything in here? Uh, I could just, you know, I could waste time dragging everything out. But let's just grab all the easy stuff, like the posters, for instance. They only take up one space each. I could decorate my base with them or something. Cabin six. Another poster. That's nothing. They're all nothing. I didn't forget anything. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's not bother with the uh, the bags. There could be posters and stuff in here. Yeah, there's a keep calm poster. It's a baked potato, that sounds nice. Um, there's nothing for me to scan, is there? I've gotten everything. Um... Okie dokie, we're good, we're good. Now, I didn't really, like, closely check. I didn't bring a fire extinguisher with me, unfortunately, but I didn't really closely check all these in case there were extra ones. I kind of just wanced over them. Those two I closely checked. What about this one here? These two. There's nothing in there, right? And there's nothing in here, right? Okay, I just want to make doubly sure I didn't miss anything. Okay, let's get out of here. What, this unrepaired itself? Why did it unrepair itself? Okay. It's re-repaired. And we've done all this. We can escape. I really shouldn't be going this way, though, should I? Oh, well. No, prawn suit's out there, but uh, I should have gone back out the entrance I came in. Because getting back to my prawn suit could be a pain. There we go. Okay, so... That was one of the things I wanted to get done this episode. Captain's Quarters and revisit the Aurora. Now, Diamonds and Quartz is the other big mission I want to achieve. Where's my prawn suit? What's it doing all the way over there? This is not safe. A bit worried. Okay. I'll get my repair drill out. Come on board, Captain. Come on board, Captain. Missed. <laughs> wonder if I can uh, mess these guys up. Are we still alive? Okay, anyway, let's stop messing around. Let's, uh, let's go get diamonds quartz. Let's go through this hole here. It'll be easier. I 
here growling and stuff. Look, Leaf Reefer Leviathan right there. What, what, really? You're gonna attack me? Oh, he's damaging me. He's taking me to 88. He's got me. I've still got you hooked, buddy. You're not escaping, dude. Okay, he is doing a substantial amount of damage to me, I will admit. I probably should stop and repair myself. Fifty-eight. Yeah, I'm drilling your neck, buddy. I'm drilling you. Yeah. Okay, this is getting scary. Maybe I have a false sense of security in this thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's... Let's get out, repair myself. Um... Where'd he go, though? The problem is, I let go of him, he takes off, I don't see him again. I can hear him. Now, sometimes when you highly damage a Leviathan, he just charges straight towards your base and starts attacking your base. Now, that's him right there. Okay. We're fully repaired. Dude, you're toast. You're toast, dude. I'm fully repaired. You will rue the day when you attack me. Okay. You're gonna admit this was self-defense. He attacked me. He came charging at me. Dude. I can't have you floating around in this area. Come back. He's gonna charge at me soon, surely. Missed. Damn. He doesn't seem very happy, does he? No! Damn, I missed him. Come back! He's like scared of me or something. Okay, I should have done that. Okay, I got him. You're toast, buddy. You can't handle the prawn suit. It's just too strong. Yeah, if I was in a um, if I was in a sea moth, he would he would like kill me <laughs> easily. Come on. I'm gonna drill your face, buddy. Ah, I'm stuck. My silver. Okay, he's got me again. But I'm drilling your face, buddy. Why won't you die? He's heading off to my base, I think. Um, okay, so I dropped a piece of silver somewhere. I have no idea where. I have to go find it. Oh, there he is. He'll come after me again. Let's see if I can get that piece of silver. I, I, I drilled a piece of silver. It fell down and it just dropped to the ground. But I have no idea where. Oh, I missed. Ah, he's running. Yeah. Spider-Man. Come back. 
See what's happening? He's like heading over to my base. This is kind of what they do when they get highly damaged. <laughs> He's not a happy camper. I got you, buddy. I'm not letting go. What's the matter, huh? Yeah, well, next time don't attack a guy in a prawn suit. We got him. <laughs> uh, it's just a shame you can't, like, harvest them. Like, I want to just go, okay, let's harvest them. Oh, what if he's still alive? Right. I want to just like eat him. Come on, you're my dinner now. Come on, dinner. Come on. Well, at least I get to scan these things. How many people get to scan a Reaper Leviathan, huh? How cute. He thought he could attack me. Oh, what? It started from scratch. It's annoying. He attacked me, okay? I'm not an aggressive jerk. It was self-defense. Yeah, I'm not getting anything from it. I should be filling my inventory with Leviathan meat right now, but uh, yeah. Okay, anyway, that was fun. Uh, why was I out here again? Oh, that's right, I wanted diamonds. <laughs> I'm so close to base, and I, I lost a piece of silver in the middle of all that, unfortunately. But yeah, there's one less Reaper Leviathan in the game now. I don't think I have any chance of finding that silver again. Welcome aboard, Captain. Captain? You mean the Victor? Oops. Did I put anything in there? No, I didn't. Okay. Anyway, uh, yeah, I, I, uh, I need, that, that's enough messing around with, uh, with the prawn suit. Let's, uh, let's get our quartz, get our diamond, and, uh, be ready to make the, uh, the cyclops. Okay, doom, 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 doom. Just a bit of uh, housekeeping, collecting up more water. Not that I'm drinking water, I'm just eating bulbo plants at the moment. Um, you know what, I'm just going to stick all my random like pictures and stuff in here. This is supposed to be a seed drawer, but yeah. You can see why I decided to take the extra first aid kit. I had a feeling that there would be a um, close encounter. There are fish in my base still, which is very annoying. Uh, okay, let's do this. Whoa, we'll get the flare out of there. Oh, that's right. I could have used a flare to distract. I don't need to distract anything anymore. Um, okay, let's... Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll do all that later. All the random garbage stuff. Yeah, even the flares. They're kind of random garbage. Fire extinguishers. They've both got a tiny bit of juice in them. They can all go in the seed chest since I'm not actually collecting seeds at the moment. Okay, there we go. Uh, I'm going to use the seam off so I'm not tempted to murder any more of the local fauna. Welcome aboard, Captain. Uh, yeah, welcome aboard, Captain. Um, diamonds. Best place for diamonds and quartz. Probably the floating island place next to the main island. If I take the prawn, I'll be likely to try and take on the, <laughs> the Reaper Leviathan on the other side of the island. So we'll take this thing and I'll play like a chicken again. We're almost at the 30 minute mark. I would like to stop very, very soon. Oops, I just killed a poor Gary fish. And... Yeah, so we'll look for this floating island place, and we'll get all the, um, the basalt and stuff. 
But if I see any quartz on the way, I should grab it, definitely. I did lose a piece of silver, which is very annoying. I should go back to that spot, see if I can find it rolling around on the floor. Oops, that was not well thought out. Oh, see, there's a large deposit of salt. I wouldn't want to mine that anyway, salt's infinite. But that's the kind of large deposit I'm looking for. There's a lot more of them in the game. They're just not near the, like, near the starting area. Or there could be lots near the starting area and I'm just blind. It's one of the two. This is, um... Go away, Bone Shark. Kind of wish I had my prawn suit now. This is not a safe place. Okay, where's islands? It should be over here somewhere. This should be island land. There we go, floating islands. Well, not floating, but oh yeah, they're partially floating. Okay, on these islands here, there's usually a lot of, um, what is it called? Shale? And I remember seeing quartz here as well. There's no shale there. There's two bits of quartz. That's one piece of glass. I was also looking for shale so that I can get diamonds, but I haven't found any shale yet. What is going on here? I don't feel very safe here. Like, dark depths. The game's gone from me being this overpowered Spider-Man mech guy to terrified chicken guy. That... Oh god, what are you doing? 78% He's attacking my sea moth. If I had a prawn, dude, I'd kill you right now. That's exactly why I didn't come with a prawn. Because <laughs> I would. I would just latch onto him and just... just just mine him to death. Okay, so... Quartz and Shale is the plan. God, I am so scared. This is terrifying. This really is a horror game. It's like... It's like... It's why I like it, really. What's his problem? They really hate this sea moth. Oh, there's a shale here. Oops, I just rammed my own. I, I don't actually... I don't want to waste time getting all the sandstone there. Diamond? How many diamonds do I need? What did I even need them for? I've forgotten. Oh my god, grow up! Okay, um... I don't need diamonds for this thing, so why am I collecting diamonds? I, I probably need it for something else. Or I probably just had very little of them and I thought I needed to restock them. I could have sworn there was a specific thing I needed diamonds for. Luckily I can outrun the um, sharks with this thing. It's gold. I can outrun bone sharks using this thing, so it's all good. Lithium. Lithium. Gold. Where are the diamonds? There they are. How many diamonds have I got? Four. Yeah, that, that's good. Let's, let's focus on quartz. Okay, I see. The quartz are kind of located on these little knobbly bits. Let's see if there's any more on the knobbly bits. That's salt, it's not quartz. Also salt, not quartz. Whoa, bone shark. 
he came from the direction of my Seamoth. That makes me a bit worried. It's a stasis rifle. Has he been attacking this thing? Yeah, it's at 85. He has been attacking it. Got Quartz. God, it's so dark and deep. It's terrifying. Quartz. There's one. That gives me lead. I mean, lead's good. I am low on lead. Stasis rifle. Yeah, I, I like the lead that I'm getting. Is that red ward? Yeah, okay. Um, oh, I'm at the 36 minute mark. So let's, um... 70%? I... I left him for a second! 60%?! Oh. Dude, you are so lucky I'm not in a prawn suit right now. I would melt your face. There's no quartz here. It's one bit of shale. Oh my god, why do they hate me? There's a bit of quartz, and there's a bit over there as well. So we'll grab this, just keep this repaired. This bone sharks are unbearable. I... I'm feeling very unsafe. What is that? That's a reef back, it's fine. It's a bone shark. Annoying little bugger. Hundred percent, what? Okay, where's my base? I need to head back. How much quartz did I end up getting? Yeah, eight, okay fine. I need to head back and then uh, put a put a stop to the episode. I might stick some stuff in my storage. That's hard to say. Stick some stuff in my storage. Um, that's good. Yeah. It's almost better if you don't shine light directly on the thing you're trying to harvest. Okay, looking for quartz. Growling. What? What? Oh no, that's the... I know where that is, yeah. Okay, let's head up over this cliff. Uh, extra long episode this time. I kind of got carried away with the prawn suit, I think. But I, I killed a Reaper Leviathan. These prawn suits are just... I just love them. I was drunk with power, okay? It's not my fault. Um, okay, I'm, I'm purposefully heading over this way because if you remember, oops, clunk, um, when I was fighting the Leviathan, I knocked over that bit of silver and I really want that silver. I could probably just grab more silver from here right now. I'm hoping there's lead here, actually. Silver, gold, no lead. Welcome aboard, Captain. Sometimes you just lose resources. I mean, technically it's my fault I lost that resource. 
But, uh, you know, if we can find that mushroom forest, which was here, and I was stuck on a ridge just next to here. Like, it's hard to see with a prawn suit, but you got a much better view with this thing. Especially if you shine your light like this. So, like, if there is a, a, a dropped piece of silver, like, on the ground here somewhere, I'm more likely to see it with the sea moth. Is it possible it just rolled down the hill? Look, look, what do you think that is? Got it. I knew that. I knew I'd find it. I just knew I would. There we go. No wasted silver ore. Back to base. End of episode. GG. Oh, GG, okay. It's not game over, but... Yeah. So yeah, just a rolling piece of silver there. Um, okay, so yep, exciting episode, long episode, but um, we've got everything we've, we've done. We've got all the resources ready for our um, for our cyclops. Yeah, we just have to uh, to make it now, and then we could start outfitting our cyclops, making it a um, kind of a temporary home away from home. It's like a moving base in a way. It's quite quite amazing. You can. You can actually build stuff onto it. Lockers, fabricator, all sorts of stuff. So that's basically what I'm going to want to do next episode. Make a Cyclops, showcase what it can do, and outfit it with uh, all the stuff that I need. Um, okay, so I'm just going to get inside, get all my stuff out of here. Where is it? Um, can I carry it all? Yeah, just, 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 just. Okay, everyone, I hope you, uh, hope you enjoyed that episode. Thanks for watching, and um, I hope you all return next episode to see what happens next. Yeah, bye for now.